help. So I'm up on the Mendips today. There's quite a special place this. I'm not going to say where. But here in the UK, we're quite lucky really, aren't we? We don't really have to worry about much. You know, like crocodiles, Bigfoot and things like that. But there is one thing that we should be wary of. And that's the UK's only venomous snake. And out here is a hot spot for the adder. And that's what I'm going to try and find today. They're incredibly elusive and they're incredibly shy. So let's give it a crack, eh? I've been out here for a few hours now and it's certainly proven to be very elusive indeed. I've seen everything but really snake. I've seen loads of little lizards, that's one of the main prey items, along with rabbits and all the little mice and voles that go with it. The sun's come out now so it's a bit wet this morning so hopefully they maybe come out basking. But yeah they're certainly proving to be a bit elusive these really um, adders. Well, not a snake. Just come across this little guy line of the path. This is a slow worm. These are not actually snakes. They're actually a legless lizard. We've got loads of these in our garden, they're beautiful little things. Even the leaf is moving very slowly, you think about it. Maybe, mate. Gorgeous little things they are. I don't want to move through anything. Trudel. Well, it's nearly there. Almost a snake. Been here, what, five, six hours? I ain't seen no adders. So hang on a minute. How is this the closing shot of the video? And I have a thumbnail of an adder for this video. Well, when I got back to the car park after this, I bumped into this old guy with two dogs. Got chatting to him about adders. And he pointed me off in a little secret location not far away where there were some tin sheets put down especially for them. Now the adder is a protected species and its numbers have been dwindling severely over the last few years due to loss of habitat and their land bridges being cut. And yes, they are venomous. They're around 100 bites a year. Mostly men trying to pick them up. But to put things in perspective, just Google the most dangerous animal in the UK and you'll find it comes up with cows. On average, one person a year dies from cows stampeding. The last person to die from an adder bite was a five-year-old in 1975. And there's only been 14 recorded deaths in the last 120 years. You've got more chance of being struck by lightning, being in a plane crash, or in modern terms, dying from COVID. Anyway, I exhausted all the metal sheets with no luck. 
I was thinking of just about to go home. Then on a bank nearby, I just noticed one sat there. Trying to get in position with the camera, it got spooked and just slithered away. And as I was headed back, there was one last sheet. And as you notice, as I pick it up here, I don't even notice it at first, but there's this tiny baby adder. Got the metal sheet in one hand, the camera in the other, no way to focus the camera. But at least I see one, eh? Finally result. It's a tiny baby. Anyways, let's go back to the ending now. So I've been here, what, five, six hours? I ain't seen no adders. Just shows how well the camouflage works, which they're renowned for. So anyway, it's been an interesting day. Nice to get out and about. That's always the same with wildlife, innit? Sometimes you win, sometimes you lose. I watched one video, some guy took him three months before he could film an adder. Just shows how elusive they are. Anyway, it's been a great day out. So, I'm gonna head home now. It's getting a bit warm. Until next time, bye!